this is Bryony from the Selfie Gaming YouTube channel and today we are playing more Genshin and if you have rolled on the beginning Whenever battle, you, you meet me, I'll be there. Thank you, Noel. You have gained yourself a Noel. And in order to yeah. level up Noel you will need Bellberries. So here's a farming route you can do every couple of days to get the maximum amount of Valberries you can. First thing you'll need to do is unlock this waypoint at Stormbearer Point and this waypoint at Stormbearer Mountains. Let's start with this one. So from here you'll want to head up north. You may as well pick up what you find. Should find your first set of valberries just over there by the mining points. And then from there you'll want to go right. And your next set of valberries will just be over here. You want to continue right, as there should be another set. Not far in this direction. Over here! Boof! Blink! Boof! Huh. There they are. Over here! Boof! And then after this, Blink. you want to head to the end Boof. of Stone Barrel Point. And I'll be another Valberry Plant. Okay, Chuck. And that is all for this particular part of the route. After that, teleport yourself back to Storm Barrow Mountains. There are three routes connected specifically to this teleport point. So the first one will do the most risky one for my current level is north. Should be as you see over there there is an arena for the animo boss. Is it the animal or electro? We'll find out. Animal. And it should be just to the left up here from the animal boss. There it is. From here, you'll want to go around. Uh, the game may start warning you if you go too far up, but you should at least be able to get around the boss the boss area without Pylon yelling at you. And follow all the way to the edge of the water. You're as low a level as me, you need to be careful. And it just be your left there. Right near the edge of the game, so just be careful. And now follow around the water south. You don't have to cross it, just follow it this way. It should be just before that. Ah, it's right next to that. Right. That's right. Yeah. Yeah. After that, get your butt out from that. And teleport back down here. For the next one, we will go about southeast. You go towards this little puddle lake on the map, then that should be pointing you in the correct direction. And there will be a valley right here. After that, you'll want to. If you have 
low stamina like I do, don't be afraid to head back and just go around. At least find a shorter bit here. I will need to continue up the mountain again. This is quite a challenging path if you're someone who is just starting out. Uh, but you can always take some more shortcuts. Just pop through the water and go around. So now shame in this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, it's very easily out and running, so you don't have to worry too much about being yeah. able to continues to follow that path to your right. And as you can see, these ones are very close. Yeah, there's other small. And continue following that path to your right. And then as it takes a turn, take a turn as well. Uh, Someone needs assistance. Yeah, back to the water. Be on the left of this little puddle here. There they are. I'll catch up. Huh. And then we go back up to the little puddle. And there should be one. Pretty much right on the end of that little puddle. The little puddle that looks like a three. Should be one. I'll catch up. You can see them just over there. So this is the third and final route, and you'll want to head in this direction. Your first set is just up on here. Right. After that, you'll want to take a left. Yeah. You're getting all these. I'll catch up. Give me chills if you wish. Huh. Oh, well, that one very much wants to hurt me. After this, continue in this direction. Slightly up here. A bit further up, and we should find the next group of berries over here. Next, continue left. You'll want to be jumping down from here. Heading over to what over here. Yes, there they are. Okay, 
Yeah, you'll want to head down. You see that cliff on the left there? You'll want to skirt the outside of that. Your next collection. After that, you'll want to turn back around and head down this way. Your next collection will be past the blue puddle on the map. And there, right there. After that, you'll want to zigzag once more. Okay. To zig in this direction and find your last set of berries. Ah, there they are. And with that, we've gone from no berries to 76. I hope this is useful for you if you're leveling up Noelle or any other characters that need berries. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please subscribe to Selfie's channel and I'll see you next time for some more Genshin.